Martina Navratilova is arguably the greatest women's player of all time. 1990 marked a milestone for the naturalized American as she took her place at the age of 34 in her ninth consecutive Wimbledon ladies singles final, having won the title on eight previous occasions. Martina's opponent was playing in her first Grand Slam final. 27-year-old fellow American Zena Garrison had proved her credentials by defeating the defending champion and top seed Steffi Graf in the semi-finals. Martina was looking for yet another record as she sought to win a record-breaking ninth Wimbledon ladies singles title. Garrison would have to hold back the hand of history if Navratilova was to be denied. We join the match at one all in the first set. Garrison to serve. Your commentators Dan Maskell, Virginia Wade and Ann Jones. Love 15. Stefino. Good, good, good. Fifteen thirty. Good defensive play by Martina then, and suddenly turned into attack, finishing with a quiet, comfortable smash. Fifteen thirty. Over, a little bit slow getting down to that uh, half volley. In fact, a bit slow getting into the net. So two break points. Oh, that's a yeah, lovely shot. Oh, that was a wonderful shot by Martina. <laughs> Navratilova leads two games to one. And Navratilova held on to that break, and we rejoin the first set with the hot favourite serving for it at 5-4. 15 love. So three set points for Martina. And all those four hands from Zena Garrison were going in against Steffi Graf. that she's hit or match. Just classic low volley. Second set, Just watch how far out in front she gets the racket and gets down to it and stays there as she hits it. Magnificent volley, always the best at low volleys. We rejoin the action at the start of the second set with Garrison up against it. So, second set. Cena Garrison serving. 15 long.
Servida. saw a really uh, a really keyed up Martina it's a good return and the volley comes back but it's a winning drive volley from below the height of the net by Martina a risky shot but uh, so she's getting keyed up I think 30 15 14 15. We're back into the second set with Garrison serving at one game all. Here's the example. If you're going to take the initiative away from the serving volleyer and come in, then you've got to be in confidently and not afraid to go for the pass. That's better. Fifteen over. The server never stopped going forward there. There was no uh, messing about, waiting to see whether she could play it right in. Aggressive volley. It's 15 all. Such a dangerous shot, the drop shot from only just inside the uh, baseline. It has to be quite perfect if you're doing it from as far back as that. 15.30. Good serve. Thank you. And that served rather different from uh, many of the others. Straight at Martina's body. Martina a little bit slow, getting out of the way of it, trying to play a forehand. Where's this service going to? Backhand, forehand, or straight to the body? Cautious, I think, when she was playing the uh, attempt at the backhand cross court pass. Advantage with number below.
break point. That's a great shot. Oh! Advantage is Garrison. Directionally perfect. Just out. Three juices in this uh, garrison service game. Zena not volleying as confidently as Martina by any manner of means. You can see she's just not punching the ball off the racket. Break point for the second time. Oh, my God. That was a wonderful uh, athletic ball over. This is a terrific ball coming up. It's a very good return of serve, and at the last moment, really controls the racket head quite perfectly. Now, that ought really to give us some confidence. Well, it was it was a missed time to have. I didn't see chalk. I didn't see it. I saw the line. I could see the I could see the line there for the ball block, yeah. So the appeal fails. Let's have a look at it again. It's a floating serve. She missed times it. And I must say from from here it looked as though it was good. But it's advantage. Never had it over. Oh. This is, they've had five deuces. This is a really tough game. She really must hang on to this serve. It's one all in the second set. About eight and a half minutes they've been playing this uh, this third game of the second set. Once the first serve in, it really does. Third time, it's break point.
Zina is really hanging on by a thread here. She didn't make that such a good overhead, but it confused Martina, and that was why Martina ended up slipping. Zina really a little lucky to still be in this game. And once again, no sign of caution there. The racket right out in front to play an aggressive volley. And she needs that sort of careless retro on off the ground too, I think. Game goes on, and they've been at it in this particular game 11 minutes now. This is about the best serve that Zena has hit, and it comes back with interest. Zina was so relieved to get it in. I don't think she really concentrated on the next shot. That out. Fourth time break. Two games to one, second set by one set to love. The match was drifting away from Garrison. We rejoin it with her now trailing by three games to one. Fifteen love. It's almost too easy for Martina when she hits that return so well. She just is stationary at the net and just puts her foot forward and makes an easy volley. And thus it is interesting to see uh, Zena play a half volley like that against the champion Steffi Graf. She was smothering mirrors, not just floating them up, but really smothering, closing the racket face on them and putting them really quite deep. That was a terribly cautious half volley there. 34. It's in, she swapped it in. 
and this is a fascinating shot that Martina plays here. The volley is bad, it's short, but it's a hooked up, whipped up forehand that draws the ball in. And if you're a golfer, you'll know what drawing the ball in is. There it is. But it's break point for a 4-1 bead for Martina. Rattled over in almost complete control. We pick it up once more with Garrison serving to stay in the match at 1 5. First service. Question about that. It was out. This volley is reasonably deep, but Martina's forehand so sharp, and she was prepared for it, ready, and the winner came so easily. About 30. Good serve. <laughs> 15 30. First ace. So two championship points for Martin Navratilova. Quite pleased, thank you. And so it had panned out as expected. A comfortable victory for the hot favourite. Huge disappointment for Zena Garrison in what proved to be her one and only Grand Slam singles final. A record-breaking ninth Wimbledon ladies singles title for Martina Navratilova. Those titles spanning three different decades. She become the greatest grass court player in the history of the women's game. She reached the singles final on two further occasions, but 1990 was the last time this superlative champion took the title at SW19. Indeed, the victory was the last of her 18 Grand Slam singles titles. A fitting full stop, perhaps, for a legend who never looked more at home than on the lawns of the All England Club.